Hey guys, in this video I'll be making my original button mechanism and coin rejection box. Cut the tips off on an angle. Space your two sides apart, just a bit more than the width of a quarter. Add a bit more support. These side pieces will hold the slide at the proper angle. And this piece will help prevent the quarter from falling through. Time to cut out our box. Crease all your tabs and flaps. Then cut out your coin slot and coin return hole. Glue two corners of your box. Cut out the coin exit slot on the bottom. Glue the coin return flap down. Then glue your slide in place just under the coin slot. Install your coin return slide. Then, glue in the side guards. Now we can glue the other two corners of the box. Use a drill bit just slightly larger than the dowel. Make sure it fits very loosely. Assemble the side rails. Assemble button 2, outer section. Button 2, inner section.
cut your wooden dowel and file it nice and smooth. Use a drill bit of equal diameter to your craft dowel. The spring should fit loosely over the stick. Keep some tension on the spring while you glue the stop in place. Now the button has a forward limit and a reverse limit. Set button 2 in the side rails and glue on the cross braces. At this point, button 2 should tilt forward easily in the side rails. Now it's time to assemble button 1. Again, keep tension on the spring when gluing the stop in place. The button mechanism is now complete. This piece of plastic pen, placed over the end of button 2, will help it to retract. Glue cardboard spacers on the side of the button to help center it. Add some cardboard support underneath your button. To help hold the button in place, we'll add another cross support. Now we'll add a coin chute to the coin rejection box. Glue your box flush with the front edge 